Hi, everyone. Um, coming at you from Standing Buffalo First Nation, where I'm really excited to be speaking to two of the artists from the Standing Buffalo Handicraft Cooperative. I'm Sherry farrell Reset. I teach at the University of Regina, also a member of Chemistamang First Nation. And I'll ask our artists to introduce themselves. <clears throat> Good afternoon. I'm Evelyn Goodtrack from uh, Tatanka Naji and that's Standing Buffalo. And I'm happy to be here today to answer some questions. Thank you. Well, good afternoon. I, my name is Marjorie Zippy. I'm standing off the First Nation. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so there's a group of rugs from the cooperative that are in the Prairie Interface. Interface? Interlace. Interlace, yeah. Um, and <clears throat> I wanted to ask each of the artists, how did you get involved in the cooperative? Lorna Ferguson. Lorna Ferguson? Yeah, that's cool. Well, she got a bunch of ladies involved in this stuff. Yeah. That's what it started. Did you get involved in the early years or did you come along a little bit? When it first started. When it, right from yeah. when it first started. Yeah, when yeah. it first started, my sister too. Yeah. We all met them. Daycare, the old daycare. Old daycare. Yeah. <clears throat> we met, and uh, it was a gathering where we all enjoyed one another's company and uh, shared designs. And our elders spoke a lot of the, about the designs, what they meant. They taught us, you know, a lot of just what the design, designs meant. And this is how we grew them, like we listened. And someone uh, taught us how to loop the rugs because it was uh, it was uh, finance, like it was money, you mm -hmm. know, to help us with our finances too, or anything. And, and we all enjoyed working together, getting together, and just sharing. Did you work as families? Did you work together on the rugs as families sometimes? No. We, we all took this, like this one, the material home. <clears throat> yeah. And we did it at home. Everybody's home. Everybody took their uh, designs and the material home. We did it at home. We didn't all work together. We did it at home. Like, yeah. You know, yeah. Chalk all away. Yeah. And sometimes our brothers or sisters would help us. That's what you need. Yeah. Yes. We showed him all the new Yeah. His mom was working there with the cool oh, yeah. boys. Eh? Yeah. My mother at that time, she was uh, <clears throat> she was in there at Coral for Day Two was many years ago. It, we enjoyed what we were doing. So she was teaching the little boys and the boys were helping her, you know, to do the designs too. Yeah, you had mentioned that um the late Clifford Goodwill also helped yeah, with the he one helped me. Yeah. yeah. That's when I did that video. Yeah. And told, he helped me and the design. He helped me with that too. Now that that was a big one. Can you tell us how you worked on that one? Oh, I worked on it during the day, in the evenings. Well, you still have to make meals, eh? So yeah. You away when you start the game. See, Clifford was a, a elder, right? Yeah, he was an elder. Yeah. You had mentioned that when you worked at night, you were working by coal oil lamp. Yes. Well, I lost my mind most of the day, yeah. Yeah. Very hard. I don't remember if they gave us a time schedule to finish no. them. I no. think it was yeah, I don't when think we so. were able Just to. Just as you finish them, you yeah. take them back and go get another one to do it. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. yeah. So you just worked at your own pace? Yeah. Yes. That's yeah. Yeah. I think it was a project that was very good. Yeah. It brought the whole community together. You know, with the elders. Yes. You heard the elders there when they talked to and share. Yes. Very nice. And like right now, we don't have hardly the elders that of that age. Yes, because they were mm -hmm. all, you know, like their 80s. 80s yeah. 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 And they seemed very happy, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> 
So which did you work with all the elders or did you have elders from because there were quite a few from the Yuzichi family in the project? Yeah. And the elders had their own homes too. Yeah, they, you yeah. Had, had their own homes too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So was Jesse Yuzichi with your grandma? Yeah. Yeah. On her father's side. Yeah. On your dad's side. Okay. Yeah. And there was two of them. Jesse and Lucy. Lucy oh, was our grandma, and that was Jesse's sister. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. And they were they came from PA. <coughs> they married, yeah, yeah, they married here on yeah. Stanley Buffalo. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> all the relationships. Yeah. Right? yeah. And there were all the music. And they were very smart <laughs> grandmas, yeah. you know, to live to be that age. Yeah. I thought, oh, they went through a lot, you know, a lot of years, and a lot of good years, I guess, to live to 80. Yeah, <laughs> you have to be doing something, right? Yes. And I'm sure Grandma Jessie B did too, right? Yeah. She could be. Yeah. yeah. I have a little purse, a uh, change purse of hers. Oh, wow. I should have dug it out. I never could. But it's a souvenir, right? So you just got to put them away. Yeah. <laughs> Your grandma always made her own moxies too. Yeah. 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 Grandma taught us a lot of things because our mother died early. Yeah. Okay. I think when I was 14, she passed away. She died when she was 49. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. Nice. yeah. With pneumonia. Excuse. Because our house is very good. Yeah, it was before you got electricity out here. Right? Yes. So the the wool came prepackaged with the yeah. Well, oh, like a little round thing like that. Yeah. Okay. No. Right. And you just picked your colors for your designs. Yeah. Yeah. And if you ran out, you took the same color of either one strand wool back. Oh, and, and match it up. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So, did they have quite a good supply? I think we had a big supply for that time. Oh, here we come. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh here we got it. <laughs> yeah. Yes. It similar to those. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, is that yeah. pretty much how it would have come back in the day? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They were pre cut. I mean, already pre cut. Yeah, that would save a lot of work, eh? Yeah. Because how would you catch them? Yeah. <laughs> Carefully. Well, I, yeah. I used to cut my own wool from the fabric line in Marshalls in Regina. Yeah. But then I had to cut my own wool there. Yeah. Well, Pearl told me about these. Her daughter, Pearl. Okay. Yeah. Our daughter sitting there. That's what I ordered for some wool that I drug. Oh, right. That's the one you're working on now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like the child I'm making. I have to pre cut those fringes. Yeah. You know, in order to uh, lift them through the designs I want. Yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> well, one of the things that, you know, um, coming to Saskatchewan, this is a very artistic community. It's a small community, but it's very artistic. There a is of, a lot of artists. A lot of artists. Here. A lot of oh, leaders, my yeah. Needs. I have a book. Uh, we had a big project down at the school. You should see all the artists there. Oh, the whole gym was full of artists. Right. And uh, my husband's niece came and made a pillow me. And then oh, she yeah. said, yeah, she yeah, said, okay, it's yeah. a book. And yeah. I got three at home. I'll have to look for it. And give yeah. me one you guys get just to look through. Yeah. All oh, beautiful artists. Oh, my God. I can't believe art, uh, artistic there. You know, so you're now, doing shawls and ribbon skirts now, yeah. <clears throat> but some of them do beadwork, quill work, and you name it. It's like they're doing it, <laughs> and they're teaching the little ones too. <coughs> Have and, you kept up with the rug? No, the rug making well, well you're making your own rugs, yeah. Yeah, I, I keep looking back and back that way for the wool. I told you, the yeah, that came in. yeah, yeah. I still haven't so have have finished yet. Like this under finish. That's her project. That's yeah. her uh what she likes to do like her hobby. Yeah. Yeah. Well, so after the cooperative stopped operating, did you keep making rugs after or did you quit for a while? Or? No, I quit for a while. Yeah. 
That was what a lot of what I did. <laughs> but there was also a lady that made book rugs with a what was it? girl? Yeah, girl. And I don't know how she made them, but I've seen a few of those girls. Oh, they're beautiful. All oh, right. Um, Florence Ryder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. yeah I have one of those. Yeah, she's an artist too in her own way. Yeah. And then you said bulrushes, eh? Yeah, Alice looked like. Yeah. She used to come down with the clothes. She'd leave her horses on top of the hill and she'd walk down to my mom's. Then she'd go to the river over there, pick all the bulrushes, and she was afraid of them. She'd sell them as work to help. Oh, right. She might even look it up and. I've never seen one yet, yeah, yeah. but I mean, they're beautiful. Well, because that's the thing, you know, that people made different kinds of rugs out of different materials yeah, before yeah. this, right? Yes, uh, yes. Yeah. I don't know how much you got there. Mm -hmm. so this day, <laughs> I've never seen one of those made again. Yeah, I've never seen one of these, so how an idea would have come and asked. Yeah. <laughs> I've never seen them in a museum. Yeah. I mean, the bull rushes are there, but I don't know how you, <laughs> what you do with yeah. your prepare. <laughs> when you were working, um, you know, on the rugs, uh, you were quite young when you started, eh? Yeah, well, yeah. I was. <laughs> <laughs> A young movie star. <laughs> well, there's that picture of you guys looking pretty glamorous. <laughs> Did you have an idea of where the rugs were going after no, they left we just, you? No, we, we didn't know. We just made them the working ones. And there's no idea. <laughs> so, you know, it's been Dawson, Grand Dawson. Yeah. I don't know where they sold them. I've never seen them again. Huh? Well, I heard, um, came across one reference to uh, Paris, that and some of the rugs were shown in Paris. Oh. Well, you went to Ontario. Yeah, London, Toronto. Ontario. Yeah. No, I'm down to London, Ontario. But oh, that okay. time wasn't rugs, it's the South Big Work. Oh, okay. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I'm down to You went with Mildred. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. We, we didn't have so, yeah, this time. We didn't have this already yet. But. Yeah. So you went to South New York. Okay. We could make boxes. We took them back. I was down there for a whole week. Yeah. <laughs> I never went there yet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you <laughs> asked me. <laughs> 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 yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, what would you like to? Me. What would you like people to know about the experience of making the rugs here? Uh, what I'd like people to know, which uh, the art gallery sent me uh, a film, uh, like recording all the art making, and I want to give the family, people that are on the list, yeah. their families, their little CDs, so they'll have, they'll tell to their grandchildren, uh, here, this is what grandma used to do, you know, and here's some good memories of what how we used to all gather and talk and laugh and come up with ideas and listen to all these beautiful uh, designs of the rug making. Yeah. There's something very, very honored here that I've been known, even with the elder things, you know, when we all got along and so that uh, and laugh and listen to our grandma's talk <laughs> and our mothers. Sharing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what about you, Marjorie? What would you like people to take away? <laughs> yes, you're still doing it, eh? There's yeah. some of your past touching. We all do. So, my granddaughter, even though there's pictures there, she's a painter. She paints a big wall. It's kind of like Chinese, Chinese drawing. Mm -hmm. but, not modern, but these are your rugs here on the wall. Yeah, these are mine. That's just a piece I have left over. Right? Yeah. It's oh, they're beautiful. Mm -hmm. Well, for those of you who will be visiting the exhibition, you'll see 
the work of this really interesting cooperative that um, you know produced a volume of rugs. You made a lot of rugs. Yeah. It, 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 I know I found one reference that there were 182 unique designs, all drawn from you know Dakota traditions. So I'd like to thank the artists for spending time with us this afternoon. And enjoy the <laughs> prairie well interviews. Yeah. <laughs> it's nice, nice to laugh with you. Yeah. <laughs> it's good to laugh and share. <laughs>